Right. Uh, yeah. Can you tell us how did you get into tech and what is your educational background? Yeah. Um, I studied uh, economics and international relations, so social sciences in college. I didn't take any. I didn't tr uh, learn to program or to code until after college. I took a uh, Python for data science EDX course online by UCSD, I think. Um, and I started getting more and more into tech and data specifically because I just wanted to do things fast. I wanted to get better at like getting things done the most effective way possible. I didn't, I didn't want to repeat myself much. So I got it. And Python was like an easy language to, to do that. And Pandas was getting like better and better. Um, and I was started as a data analyst. I was a researcher in public policy. And then I got into data visualization because I really wanted to get, uh, to be able to explain what I was doing. And then anyone that's worked in data science or data analysis is going to know like it, you need good data and <laughs> you need to transform the data a lot. So that I started slowly getting more and more into the data engineering aspect of things. And then that's, that's where I've been in the last couple of years. I just, I got, I'm really interested in, in building in the data engineering aspect of things right. so I can help build the things for other people to do what they're best at and not spend time, you know, cleaning and pre-processing the data. Right. Uh, just the researchers can focus on the research thing and I'll, I'll take care of the data. I'll get it in the, in the right shape for them. Yeah. Right. Yep. Yeah. 